No, is this Kenny? Alright. I have no idea the skill level of Kenny. Yeah, but okay, it looks so like this is the match. Yeah, so so we have Kenny, Ke uh, Quan, Alan as Alan. Indeed. It looks so like Kenny's not ranked. Kenny is not ranked. He had uh, a pretty good set versus Shroom earlier, actually. That was a, or yeah. I'm sorry, versus S Fat. That was pretty impressive. Some people. There was some controversy where a bunch of his supporters thought he should have been ranked a couple periods ago. Okay. And then he took maybe a small break, a little hiatus or something, and. Uh, he looks pretty right solid, back. dude. Yeah. So Kenny is. Uh, I mean, he's going. I mean. Falcon versus Yoshi, yeah. as you can see, in the stocks is a pretty hard matchup. So, Kenny has a very safe style. Definitely a believer in Falcon's back air. I am not a believer in Falcon's really? back air. Really? It's amazing. Nah, what do you think about the stage pick? I feel like this is a bad choice. Okay, so this is... Because you can get tech chased to death. Conventional wisdom is that this is Falcon's counter pick in the matchup. But okay. Alan believes that it is, in fact, Sheik's counter pick and not Falcon's counter pick. So I feel like it could go both ways. Like, if the Sheik yeah. is really good at shield dropping or abusing platforms, it can be really bad. Yeah. Um, so, or, I'm sorry, you know, a platform stage. So I can see why he picked this. I don't necessarily agree. Go on with that. Yeah, you know, it's, it's really hard. Against Alan, you almost have no choice but to go here because he'll, he'll ban uh, Dreamland and Battlefield, which leaves you with Yoshi's. FOD or FD. Okay. And ah, almost, that's yeah, annoying. yeah. So Falcons, they'll basically never go to FOD. A couple ones like me or Lord might consider going to Yoshi's just because we, you know, like right. Yoshi's, think we're comfortable there. But overall, you know, on paper, this is supposed to be the Falcon stage, and those other ones are not. So like, he kind of forces your hand. He always he always strikes Battlefield first, also, and if he goes first, and that can kind of sometimes feel like a kick in the nuts because people like kind of expect to go there. Right. I don't know. I feel like this stage would be really annoying. I would not go here as Falcon. <laughs> I don't mean oh! Falcon, but that was amazing. Yeah, right, that, that was, was amazing. Slap. He had some deceptive movement with that yeah. tech chase. Oh, oh, caught him sleeping. He forced the approach too. Yeah. Like that was the worst knee. Yeah. I think that was a really bad knee, <laughs> but it just worked. So who believe am I? me, I would have done it, and then I would have. Got it, it? Or tilted, and I'd be like, God, I'm so stupid. Why would I ever think that would work? Okay, that's actually a pretty good option that Sheiks nice. don't do that much, where if you just run into the Falcon and then, like, jump in there, it really cuts off a lot of his things. He has to, like, beat you Ooh. out beforehand. Yeah. Yeah, so Alan is kind of a specialist in this matchup. He, uh... Who are his practice partners? You know, I don't think he... You know, people... Don't really practice this matchup. <laughs> no one likes. <laughs> no, that's true. No one likes this matchup. But I like that there that you, talk, that you yeah. I can see where he's abusing it. He's kind of uh, blocking yeah. off his approach, or at least at minimum, it's gonna be trading. Yeah. And especially when he's up in the stock, it doesn't really matter if he's trading. So Alan, an original Peach main, he really hated Falcon, and he say they always like lame him out. So he developed Sheik as a counter pick to, huh. as an answer to Falcon's lameness, to try to out lame him with a character that's better at playing lame in the matchup. <laughs> so it sounds like Alan's lame. Uh, you know, he has absolutely no qualms about, like, yeah, ledge camping. Oh, there we go, there nice. we go! Let's go, Quan! Okay. Nice, yeah. Let's see what we can do with this. Kenny Quan keeping it closer than I would have expected. He's getting a couple hits and a zero to death. Like, uh, I think I remember Alan four-stalking Jungle Guy on this stage. Really? When Jungle Guy was at BAM. So... Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. I think he's just kind of... Oh okay, my god, it go. feels like he's messing around with that forward tilt. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. Like, that forward tilt... Honestly, I think he down smashed and he really would have cared. Dude, yeah, yeah, I agree. <laughs> Speaking of juggle guy, I have a joke for you. Oh yeah? What do you call a fat juggle guy? What? A round robin. <laughs> uh, that was pretty good. That, that's that's top of evolved. <laughs> Sheridan disapproves. Oh, you thought yeah. it was Sheridan approves? Yeah. All right. I liked it too. Good choice in stage. He's giving himself a lot of space here. That's smart. Yeah, I think this is a an excellent counter pick for Falcon. Uh, so, I think Falcon benefits more from platforms than Sheik in uh, in this specific matchup, and it's because kill setups come pretty easily for Falcon off platforms. What do you think of Dreamland this matchup? Uh, I think Dreamland is not very good in this matchup okay. because the platforms are too high for it to allow for the kill setups I just ah. talked about. Also. Like, on Battlefield and Yoshi specifically, uh, the platforms are really easy to kill her, like, as a ledge guarding tool. If exactly. You, if she poops onto the platform, it's easy. But on... Or Dreamland, she goes too hard. She yeah, yeah, too hard. it's too hard. Oh, Here, the platforms are a little bit farther into the stage, so it doesn't usually matter. But anyway, yeah, like, getting a tech chase on the platform Ooh. results in kills really easily on every stage besides Dreamland. Okay, I agree with that. 
Okay, uh... Oh, unfortunately missing the uh, recovery there. Yeah, so... Recovery punish. I'm not sure if he did it there. I'm about 80% sure he did. But if she lands at the very tip, she only has half the landing lag. And that makes reverse knee ledge guard not possible. Alright, hopefully he... Oh, oh there he, Yeah. He definitely could have done it there, though. That sucks. He's gonna need to pick this up, dude. Yeah, Kenny is not the best at dealing with uh, people on the ledge. Or at least, I've seen Laudan just lame him out. And Alan might be going that route. That's one thing that Falcon is not the best character at the ledge. So you have to be really like crispy and really uh, space well. I agree, especially with the way uh, Alan's punishing. Like he's gonna need to pick up oh, everything damn. he can. Yeah, you take those. Alan is not the best at like once you hit him, you can really go in. But he makes the most off his hits, and he's good in the neutral. So yeah, you just have his only real yeah. weakness in the matchup is like sometimes missing DI or. I see combo DI. Yeah. Which happens. Yeah. Peace out, dude. Later, Miles. Kenny, not. Alan seems annoying, dude. Yeah, he's. Is he he's, annoying to play? He's okay on on a bad nope. <laughs> on a bad day where I'm like not playing my best. He's my least favorite person to see <laughs> in the blood racket. He seems like he punishes pretty annoyingly. I like, respect it, obviously. He, but, uh, he, he has no qualms about just <gasps> waiting in the neutral. That was game. sick. Yeah, that Let's go. Holy crap, Hopefully, he picks sick. up this edge guard. Yep. Oh, no, missing the down in the knee. Gosh, she's gonna need to pick those up, dude. Yeah, ledge guarding Sheik is what Falcon has that makes this matchup mm. almost even. Yeah, it's because he ledge guards Sheik so hard. No, that's an up throw knee. Oh, God, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the frustration. I know, dude. We can hear dude, it. Dude, it's because he's doing pretty well in the neutral, but like he just <laughs> no up. Throw. Right. He just oh, All right, let's see. So, reading the spot. That's yeah. I, that's something Falcon players have started doing a lot lately. Is like doing a short hop and just reading the spot dodge there, forcing yeah. it pretty much. So that that's so kind sick. of. Not just with DI, what I said about Allen, but like what I mean just in general, once you actually get him on defense, you can force errors. The hard part is getting him on defense. Mm. Oh my god, that situation sucks. Yeah. You have to know your punishes. Gotta yeah, do that hack pack. Yeah, so that's you know, that's kind of Kenny's problem here. That, okay, Ooh, nice. that's a that's a new two king thing. Yep. Yeah, he's, yeah. he's being so sick with it. Sick with it, boys. Yeah. So if Falcon can't ledge guard cheek efficiently, this matchup is absolutely hopeless. It's actually, I think this matchup is perfectly doable if, you know, you ledge guard and you get your grab combos. But he hasn't really been getting that. It's, I, I also just, it's really hard to grab Alan, so it's hard to say, like, go for more grabs, but I really think he should try. Yeah. This, is, this is the juicy percent. This is up throw up air percent, and then, you know. I feel like guard. he's overcommitting too much. Like he's you know, many guesses, in, to just in this like matchup, almost here. everything feels like oh, overcommitting. Yeah, oh, there you yeah. Go. I, I feel like that too. Yeah, because yeah. like there's certain situations where like he would have to take a good guess. Yeah, it's really it's really hard in that matchup to. Uh, it's hard to play safe, but also apply you know enough positional pressure to actually be playing.